Hi, my name is James Leroux. I'm a senior model maker here at Oakley. Uh, every year I get asked to make uh, these trophies and today we're putting together a little film to show you exactly what it takes to get one of these cool trophies. Uh, the first step is to make an armature of the frog. I want to try to get somewhat close anatomy, not perfect anatomy. I'm not trying to make a perfect uh, representation of a frog. I'm, I'm using a, a design to help me establish just the surfaces on the frog. Um, I th I'm thinking about this frog as the way I would uh, sculpt one of our sunglasses here. And uh, I'm looking at the surfaces and how each surface melds into each other. It's almost like a, uh, how a car body is put together. At this step, I'm looking uh, at different kinds of landmines, just, just trying to decide which uh, shape I like. Um, I decided on a shape that we are now looking at in the computer. We designed the uh, landmine in the computer uh, to give it a geometrical st uh, structure. Once I have a printout of uh, the, f the landmine from the computer, I start to put the clay on. As you see here, I'm packing on the clay and creating the frog. I put the armature on top of the uh, landmine itself and then pack clay around it. Um, just the original sculpt took me about 45 hours uh, to complete so I could get ready to mold it. Once I get the sculpture done, I'll be casting a two-part uh, urethane resin into the mold to get the final piece. Um, this step here, I'm mixing up the resin and then I will be pouring the mixture into the uh, mold. Um, once the two chemicals are mixed together, it's a, they create a reaction together and then form a hard uh, part. Here I'm pouring resin into the mold. Carefully crack it out of the mold. Uh, try not to break anything. Uh, as you can see here, the frog doesn't really like to come out of the mold. It takes a lot of work to get them out of there. Uh, here I am cleaning up the flashing that comes from the mold seam where the mold, the two pieces of the mold come together. There's a slight uh, little flashing there, so I'm cleaning all that up. Um, I'm using uh, a spray can to paint this. It's uh, our favorite uh, olive drab green that we just love so much here at Oakley. And I put a little black spritzer on it just to give a little bit of a camouflage look. Uh, once that's done, I'll mix up some colors to do the eyes. Uh, when I'm doing these eyes, I'm thinking about our red uh, iridium lenses, so I try to mix a paint color that kind of matches those. So this is uh, Jupiter in all his glory. As you can see from uh, all these steps that I've uh, taken you through, it's a very uh, labor-intensive process to get uh, one of these trophies. I do it just because this is the coolest place to work on Earth.